What's up guys, this is Balash from Racing Brick. As you might remember, I was in Billund recently at the 2022 LEGO Fan Media Days. We saw many exciting new things in advance, some of them were already revealed, like the Ideas foosball table, the creator set with the paper bags or the Ideas winners, and there will be still more coming. But that was only one aspect of the event, the other one was the great possibility to meet other ambassadors from all around the world and to know more about their communities. One of the participants was Boris from Stuck in Plastic and he was kind enough to give me this book which I will show you today. The title is In Focus and it is a very very nice coffee table book focusing on LEGO toy photography. Toy photography is a very popular hobby with many communities all around the world and LEGO photography is a specific area that also has many participants and fans. The book features the work of two LEGO communities, Brick Central and Stuck in Plastic. I really suggest to check their web pages and other social media platforms, there are some very talented photographers in these communities and you can participate in some fun activities as well. As a personal note, when I came back to LEGO from my dark ages, my concept was first to shoot photos as I already had photography as a hobby back then, I was roaming the city by night and was playing with light a lot. I made some custom builds and did put tons of effort to achieve a specific look for a shot, unfortunately nowadays I have less time to focus on this aspect of the LEGO hobby. So, this book is published by Chronicle Books, it is an official LEGO release, you can actually buy it on lego.com for $30 or €29, Euros, but it is available on Amazon and in other bookstores as well. We get a nice foreword from Tormod Askilsen, the head of AFL engagement, then an introduction about the two LEGO toy photography communities featured in the book, and then photos, tons of very nice photos. Each of them has some background information or a little story from the photographer, which adds a lot to the experience. I'm sure some of you will say LEGO toy photography is all about placing minifigures in a scene and taking photos of them with dreamy blurred backgrounds. Yes. That is one trend that you can find frequently on LEGO photography sites, but it can be done in a funny, inspiring or thought-provoking way and you will find many good examples in this book. Additionally, this collection tries to show way more aspects of this hobby and I really appreciate that. I don't want to spoil everything, but we have Technic shots, Speed Champions action shots and some very cool abstract concepts with LEGO bricks that will tickle your brain for sure. If you are a fan of LEGO photography, then I can highly recommend this book as it is a much better experience than simply scrolling social media. If you want to know more about LEGO photography or even try yourself, then again, it can be a great source of inspiration to start your journey. If you were shooting LEGO photos in the past but stopped doing it for whatever reason, then this book might give you the nudge to start taking photos again. It actually happened to me after admiring the great work of many talented photographers in this book, I scrolled through my long abandoned Flickr page and I started to feel the urge again to take my time and shoot nicely composed stills besides focusing only on videos and reviews, so to everyone involved in the creation of this book, thank you for that. Please let me know your thoughts in the comments, are you involved in LEGO photography, would you like to try it, well, let's talk about it. If you like this video then please give it a thumbs up, I also suggest to subscribe with notifications as more exciting LEGO videos are coming soon. See you next time, bye bye!